What's up guys, I'm Random Frank P. Today we're going to be building a sick black and white gaming PC. Had a lot of requests for this one, and actually won the vote that I put up on Twitter a few weeks ago. And I love black and white builds, it's kind of my favorite aesthetic, so really happy to be doing this. Uh, the case that I'm using is the Fractal Defined C, it just came out. And I'll be dropping my review on this tomorrow morning, so make sure you don't miss that, it is awesome. But I'm really psyched for this guys, it's going to be a crazy black and white build. And check the description down below, I'll put all the products and components we used down there for you. Now for this build, we're going to be going with the new Fractal Defined C case. It's more so a mid ATX chassis, but I think it is a perfect size overall and it stays true to the previous Fractal case design. At $85 for this windowed version, it is a great buy and has a ton of likable features. The window will obviously give you a look inside at all your components, and since this is going to be a build for the interior aesthetics, that's important. The brushed metal front panel is eye-catching, it's tasteful and won't show fingerprints or anything, and then along down the sides of the case are vents to keep your PC cool, which is one area in particular this case flourishes in. When you take off that front panel, we have a mesh dust filter that is structurally sound, it's nothing cheap or flimsy here. You can take that off for access to mounting fans or radiators there in the front, then you can easily snap it back into place with the clips and you're good to go. There's also an easily removable dust filter on the bottom like they've had before. There's a lot of room on the inside of this case for building. And like I said, stay tuned tomorrow for my dedicated review on this case, because there is a lot of great things about the Defiant Sea that you're not going to want to miss out on, and I'm pumped to be using this for my sick white and black build. For hardware, first we're going to be using the MSI Z170A M Power Gaming Titanium Motherboard. Obviously the main appeal for me to use this here is its appearance. You don't see a lot of motherboards this color and it's going to fit in great with our black and white build. It's also got some great features like insane overclocking abilities, fantastic onboard audio, the titanium build is going to make the board stay cool, and again, it's just that really awesome appearance. Probably the nicest motherboard I've seen. For RAM, we're going with four 8GB sticks of Vengeance LED memory. Again, to complement the aesthetics of this build, I chose this because when it is powered on, the RAM has these built-in light bars that pulse and really give it a nice appearance and extra flair, because that's what we're going for. Keeping our i5 6600K CPU cool, it's going to be the Deep Cool Captain 240EX AIO. I used the black and red variant in a previous build, you already know why I'm picking this, I don't need to say it. I do however really like the closed loop design to this, and it has another built in light on the cooler itself. And guess what, the Corsair ML120 Pro LED fans on the radiator will help keep temperatures down, and the built in lights on this is also going to give it the build a nice overhead glow as it shines down. These fans are great and are really quiet, which is why I picked them too. Then for the main feature here, our GPU is my favorite, the Galax 1080 Hall of Fame. I did a review on this recently, it performs flawlessly and for the hundredth time is going to look great inside. The white and silver accents on the card will complement the hardware and motherboard perfectly. It also has some built in LEDs and the back plate is nickel. It's going to be the main thing you see inside the window of the case, so obviously we had to go with this. Now let's get into the build.
Alright guys, that'll do it for my build of the black and white gaming PC using this awesome Fractal Defined C case. Don't forget, like I said, make sure you're subscribed because tomorrow morning I'll be dropping my review on this case. It is awesome if you haven't seen already. A lot of great things. And I just love doing these PC builds. It's really, it's relaxing in a way because you can just pick a cool theme, buy the hardware for it, and go all out. I think black and white is one of the nicer kind of builds you can do because it's kind of classy and modern. And it just looks so clean at all times, especially when you do it and build it right. In this case, it has great cable management and stuff like that. So we really, at the end, got a fantastic result of a sick gaming PC. And uh, just loving the extra flair that some of the LED lights inside add as well. So also, I'll put all the links to the products and components I use in the description down below. And if you're liking this PC, give this video a big thumbs up. And let me know down below if you want to see more PC builds. I do have a sponsored $500 gaming PC coming up very soon that we're going to be building. But in terms of like crazy color combinations, let me know what you might want to see in the future. Well guys, I'm Random Frank P. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day.